now it doesn't look good. But uh, let's start with our new video of the day. With our new walk of the day. So I just met my neighbor and we had that interesting conversation. What it all boiled down to is that, in fact, living a extraordinary life doesn't mean living a rich life, doesn't mean living a poor life either. Doesn't have anything to do with money or the lack thereof. It has to do with not living like everybody else does because otherwise it would be ordinary so extraordinary it sounds very pretentious but it doesn't have to be what we have to keep in mind though is that if you want to live an extraordinary life you cannot keep doing extraordinary things. That's just uh, not how it works. There are a lot of people, I guess, who want an extraordinary life, but I always think, uh, yeah, you should be afraid of what you wish for. It's not easy for anybody. Uh, for example, for eight years straight, I can do whatever the fuck I want all day long. Yeah, you could, you could get me from, okay, you can't get into a private jet now and then fly to Dubai, have a party and then fly to uh, Milan, have another party. No, no. That not, that not, I, I was never in that position. But what I could do, and still can, is I still can stand up when I want to, go to bed when I want to, have my meals whenever I want to. And I think that's, uh, yeah, that's what some people consider <laughs> extraordinary. I. I, I consider it rather ordinary for me personally. It's something that you get used to and um, would also be devastating if it's taken away from you when you have to ask, when you have to ask. But if you have to do s stuff that you actually don't want to do. Yeah, and that's, that's a problem what I think a lot of artists have that at a certain point in their life they have to go back to something that they don't like. I personally have the biggest problems with having to. I don't want to have to anything. I think a lot of people have that. Some people lay it aside, just uh, accept it. I find that hard to accept, ever have, and uh, yeah, I enjoyed the last eight years of doing whatever I want to do, when I want to do it, and in uh, some regards, as with most things in life, I think I should have enjoyed it more, you know, often as human beings, we tend not to value the stuff that we have in the moments where we have them. Or the situations that we are in, we don't value them. We don't uh, think about how great they actually are. Yeah. And uh, what it all boils down to is living in the moment and enjoying the moments and value them. That's so important. 
call being on the brick, uh, on the brick, not on the brick, on the brink of losing all that. What's actually a quite a privileged life style, life form, however you want to call that. Yeah, I uh, don't have a lot of regrets, but I think I should have enjoyed enjoyed some situations more than I did. Yeah, it's also true for other things in life. Way, way back in time. But that said, it's late, I'm hungry, I'm going home and prepare a nice juicy meal. So, thanks for watching and have a great evening. Goodbye, friends.